In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create a plant list for your planting plant. And the benefits to this is that if you are showing the quantity and the material, a landscape contractor can easily understand the drawing and could quickly estimate your plans for the clients or for your project. So to create a plant list in AutoCAD, we're gonna to go to the annotate tab. We're gonna use the table command just under the middle of the drawing. A box like this will appear where you can enter the information that you want when you click OK, you can insert the table anywhere into AutoCAD. And the moment you click Insert, you are given the option to start typing within the table. Now, just like Excel, you can add rows or columns to this table. And to do that, hover over the box and select one of the rows. When the row is selected, right-click and you can insert row below or above. If you want to adjust the heights of the rows, Simply select all, right click, and go to properties. And we're gonna focus on table height. I'm gonna change this to two inches to four inches. Now that I have bigger blocks, I'm going to take the symbol from the landscape plan and put it into the plant list. I've adjusted the plant list to fit what I need to show, but once you have all the information needed, you're gonna simply go over to the planting plan and we're going to select similar and AutoCAD is going to highlight all of the blocks that are the same, but we already have the one in the plant list located. So this quantity will actually be 10. And once you have all this filled in, this can be uh, inserted into the paper space tab by the viewport, or it can be copied and pasted onto the landscape plan. For AutoCAD training, go to thelandscapelibrary.com or subscribe now for more videos and trainings.